Hey guys and welcome back to Setforce. So today we're going to be taking a look at the PowerUp 3.0. Now if you don't know what this is, it's essentially a module which can be bought and attached onto most paper airplanes to make them remote controlled through your mobile phone. So if you're interested in this product, please stick around to find out some more. Okay, so let's begin by taking a look at what comes inside the box. So along with the PowerUp 3.0 module, we get a few necessary accessories. This includes a micro USB charging cable, the manuals, four paper templates to build two different plane models, a display stand which simply allows you to dock your plane when not in use, and lastly a horizontal stabilizing stick which I think is used to adjust the weight distribution and also offer additional protection and structure to the wings. So we do get enough stuff in the box for the $50 we're paying for this product. However, one small thing I was hoping for was spare propellers as these generally do come with any drone sort of product due to the high chance of the props breaking. But then again, because the prop is at the back, there is a slim chance of it being broken. So it should last a while. Okay, now let's move on to what you guys want to hear about, the flight performance. So my experience of testing out this product and trying to get it flying wasn't amazing. It does take a little while to learn how to fly it properly and although the controls aren't are very easy to use, I feel it is hard to get this plane up in the air to actually fly well. Personally, I think this could be down to the lack of thrust generated by the motor as the plane does sometimes struggle to hold its altitude and does end up stalling and gradually descending. But overall you are given a very in-depth tutorial on how to set up this plane and get it working. This involves being shown how to actually make the paper planes as well as how to adjust the position of the rudder and adjust the characteristics of the plane for a better flight. So in terms of the help and guidance offered, uh, I think it's very good and very useful. Now in my eyes, this is not a product which teaches you how to fly an RC plane or any RC vehicle. It's more the process of actually learning how to develop a paper plane which is able to fly well. So I actually think it's a very good educational toy as you could experiment with different plane models and actually learn how changing the weight distribution can affect the flight significantly. You're also able to learn about how lift is generated and how planes are able to turn in flight. And all of these skills are very very good and are certainly transferable into real life planes. Okay now aside from all this, Power Up 3.0 was quite hard to get flying and does require some experimentation to figure out what works and what doesn't. I think one of the reasons it struggles to fly is that when you're at full throttle this doesn't seem to be enough but then again Power Up have actually provided a boost button which I believe is meant to generate more thrust to help the plane recover when it's getting close to the ground. But I think this button isn't great and to be honest, they should just scrap this boost button altogether and have the motor at its highest potential speed when the throttle is at 100%. But if you learn how to use this boost button which just comes with practice, I think the Power Up 3.0 would be an amazing toy for you guys to just mess about with and just have some fun. Okay, now the battery life is actually pretty good. You get 10 minutes of flight time, which is all right considering it's such a small module. And then it only takes about 20 minutes to charge, which is a lot less time than other drones and RC planes out there. Now in terms of design and durability, I think the Power Up 3.0 is very well built. It can simply slot onto any paper plane. And sometimes they say a bit of tape can be used to help secure it on near the back but this isn't always needed. Aside from this, it also has a soft rubber nose, which prevents it from being damaged if crashed uh, into the ground. And during my use, I actually did crash it quite a bit, and the plane did manage to remain in perfect condition with no tears at all. Sometimes there would be some small creases in the paper, but that was only a little bit of damage, and it still flew the same, even though it experienced as little damage. So overall, I would say that the Power Up 3.0 is a good product to buy if you're interested in planes and also interested in remote controlled flying. It's certainly great for kids who want to learn about how planes actually fly, as there is a lot to learn from using this kit. But then again, it does take a bit of patience and experimentation to get it to fly perfectly. 
So it wouldn't be for someone who simply wants to start flying right away. So for $50, you guys can go and pick up this product by clicking on the link in the description below. And whilst you're there, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching and goodbye.